So as the markets continue to crumble, here's something to take your mind off the depreciating portfolio. And what that is, is an airdrop. Everybody loves airdrops, it's free, and everybody's happy about it. And this one, I think it's pretty interesting because all you gotta do is just play a game. So what I'm talking about today is Alluvium. Now we've uh, been talking about Alluvium for over a year, about a year and a half now. And uh, I've had uh, both the Warwick brothers on and, and we talked about the game itself. And uh, it looks like a pretty interesting game. Uh, hopefully it'll all work out. What's great about this one is that of course they have four games that are already released, which is pretty interesting in uh, today's environment when people just talk about, yeah, we're gonna do this thing, we're gonna do this thing, and then they don't do it. And they've got four. So they got uh, Overworld, which is like an exploration game, Alluvium Zero, which is like a builder city type game, the Arena, Auto Battler, and then Beyond, which is a card-based game. Now, I'm not an enormous gamer, but you know, just to like kill some time and keep me away from the portfolio, this might be something uh, to do. And then if we're taking a look at the, the game itself, uh, this is the actual gameplay. And uh, yeah, this is just moving around. Again, again, there's four different games to actually play, and that's fantastic. And again, this... The token itself, which is the Alluvium token, is for the Dow. And as a reminder, uh, when this game had absolutely nothing going on, it reached a price point of 1,844. Now, there's different points of this as far as like uh, the circulating supply and the total supply was actually unlocked. But right now, we're sitting at a paltry uh, $93. And in the last uh, 24 hours, it's down 10%. So I think this, again, has a uh, room to run, especially in the Web3 gaming. So let's try to get you some uh, airdrops, right? So here's how it works out. There's there's actually a link for everybody, which looks like this. And there's a link for you guys, which looks exactly like this, looks the exact same way. And what I want you to do is on this link, you can sign up and for the airdrop, they are going to choose so many people to actually be included in that, which you play the game. And the more that you actually play it, the more that you actually earn the airdrop. And that's for everybody else. And this one right here, which looks the exact same, just is for the digital asset news uh, community and the family. So you guys can go in there. I would register on both just so you can get chosen and uh, go from there. But here's what it all really comes down to. Here's the actual airdrop detail. So they talked about today, we're launching one of the largest airdrop campaigns. Uh, 5,000 Alluvium tokens are dedicated to our lawyer holders and a gigantic 200,000 set aside for our six month play to airdrop initiative. Imagine that, all you do is play and you know you actually earn Alluvium. Before we go on, I will just say like, some people are like, well, I'm not a big gamer, Rob, I don't wanna do this. Well, do what I do. Just uh, talk to your family members. Like I talked to my grandson, like, hey, you wanna play a game and earn something potentially? Yeah, sure. So it's up to you how you handle this. I'm just saying, you know, make them work a little bit. So that's what we have for here. And then to go into the, the nitty gritty of it, Alluvium play to airdrop campaign. The more you play, the more points you earn. How do you earn airdrop points? Earn a piece of the 200,000 uh, airdrop in the, you can battle in the Alluvium arena, all four different games. And uh, of course, we'll have a point system for activities across all games. So airdrop number one, 20,000 Alluvium. The first 10% allocation is IL, our Alluvium token dedicated to the testnet phase. PB4 began on April 30th and open beta testing set to start on May 28th. So again, what you're doing is you're using the link, which is private beta four pre-registered here, which looks like this. And I'd also like you to register over here to double your chances with the digital asset news link itself. Open beta, and of course, if you didn't get into the early round, that's okay. Once we finish the early, early rounds, we'll open the gates to the public and everyone can earn airdrop points for playing. Remember, the more you play the four games, the more points you earn. And as a reminder, the earlier, or earlier you are in, the better it might actually behoove you as far as like the airdrops. Airdrop number two, 108,000 Alluvium. Uh, this is where we transition to mainnet for the first time. This portion of the campaign will last an additional five months. Player will earn airdrop points across all of our games. And then, so that is there. Links are in the description. Obviously, you can check that out. And then, as a reminder, you can also stake uh, your Alluvium tokens if you have those right now. And it's a very easy process. What I did was I actually uh, sat down with Kieran Warwick, who was one of the co-founders, and we did this a couple of weeks ago. So just take a listen to this it's about four minutes or so. Let's do this. I know it's somewhere here. We're on this website. We're on Alluvium.io, right? Yeah. So like if you go top left, uh -huh. yeah, click that one, go to staking, Alluvium DAO, yep. Yeah. Okay. And next, ne well. Yeah, so this is your dashboard. So this will show you the emission schedule 
Uh, we're, we're nearly at the end of that. So there's only seven more epochs to go. It'll show you uh, our token price, how many holders there are, how much uh, mm -hmm. ILV is actually staked. It will give you uh, the distribution of uh, both pools because you can either stake just pure, pure ILV or you can yeah. stake in the uh, ILV slash ETH pool. And so this gives you a nice uh, layout of what's going on. But if you want to stake, you go to the third tab there on staking. Uh -huh. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Yeah, I'll use the my least favorite wallet of all time, MetaMask. No worries. So, all right. So I connect to my wallet. What's next? Yep. So now you've got your breakdown of two pools. You've uh -huh. got uh, the total value locked in in each, and the APY is there. Obviously, yeah. the ILV ETH pool has a lot higher uh, APY, but Let's just keep it simple and uh, and stake in the ILV pool because they they both get the same amount of revenue distributions. Okay, so we'll click on stake before you continue. Versus you approve your wallet, approve, and of course now you at home you might see this, you might not because this is MetaMask and they'd like to shield things. But it's going to ask you to a custom spending cap. You're going to click on next and you're going to approve that and approving ILV spend. View on Explorer. We'll wait. That is pretty easy, Kieran. I got to tell you. It sounds very complex, but it's like six or seven clicks, really. Yeah, that's pretty good. I don't know if you can see that. Transaction 102 confirmed. All right. Okay. So we and approved this one. Approved. So now if you go stake. Oh, I see. Yeah. I see. Let's do, so, I'll do 75%. Okay. And now your duration. So uh, depending on how much, uh, how long you stake for, that's going to give you. Uh, up to a 2x multiplier. So if you do uh, the full 12 months, you're going to mm -hmm. get a 2x. If you do six months, you're going to get a 1.5x. All right. Well, I'll do ah, I do 12 months. I, I think I think this bull one's going to be nice. Let's see. Stake. Okay. And then, of course, now you can't see this as well. There's going to be something that's going to come up from MetaMask asking me to confirm this transaction. Uh, fees. Well, of course, it's Ethereum. What are you going to do? Uh, roughly, uh, not too bad, $7. For, for Ethereum, I'm feeling pretty great. It's why it's late. <laughs> we did uh, <clears throat> we did update our staking application to go to V2, which saved about I would say like 200 percent on nice. our gas fees. It was it was pretty crazy in the beginning. In the bull run last uh, like two and a half years ago, people were it was costing them like 500 bucks just to accept their rewards. It was just crazy. Hey, so remind me. Well, let's just talk about this now before we get we, we finish this up. Is there any plans for doing anything as like layer twos or something like that? Because we know what's happening here with, with layer one ERC 20s. Anything happening in the background? So we're building on top of immutable. So all of these all right. transaction costs won't exist for the user in game. Our, <clears throat> our DeFi stuff which includes staking which you know as this rolls out and these revenues start coming in a big part of what investors are going to want to do is jump in and start uh accepting their revenue distributions if you look right. down the bottom left it says rev dis claimed so yeah. you'll be able to you'll see that as you start claiming your distribution which is on the right and so, and as you can see, you've already started earning some ILV on the left there. Nice. And so uh, as people claim, we feel like we're going to need to move uh, our B3 to a layer two as well. And so, uh, yes, that, there's definitely plans there because it's not great to be claiming and it costing you, you know, 15 bucks or whatever. It's, it's not mm. a good experience. I got to agree. And that's right now. We know what's going to happen in the next bull run. So. Gotcha. Exactly. All right. So, Kieran, that was good. You gave us an update. You showed us how to stake. I got to appreciate it. So, everybody at home, if you're looking for the information we just talked about, there's going to be links in the description for everything. Uh, Kieran, any last words of wisdom for the people coming in in the next uh, run here? Uh, I would just say get for, uh, for the people that are hunting around uh, different airdrops, we have a very, very large airdrop that's coming. It's going to start in our test net. 
So yeah. there'll be uh, prior to us going live on mainnet, there'll be a bunch of testing that we're doing and uh, the airdrop will extend to that testing period and then it will move into uh, production as well. And yeah, I haven't announced uh, how much it's going to be, but it's very, very, very big. So uh, definitely your listeners should uh, should participate in that. Time to start playing. Cool. Great. And that's it. So I hope that made sense. I just want to bring that to everybody's attention. And uh, of course, free airdrops. Everybody loves that. Like today's video, give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. Everything we talk about is time sensitive. That's it for today. Thanks so much for stopping by. I do appreciate it. And I'll see you on the next one.